Hey guys, so I'm going to be doing a fall fashion haul um, part two. Um, so I did a video for the makeup, so like I mentioned in my first video, like I've just been on a bit of a shopping binge, I feel like. Um, I'm definitely a retail therapy kind of girl, so don't judge me. But um, I, thought I found a lot of great deals, so I really wanted to um, share them with you guys and Hopefully, you, if this is some stuff that you like, you can still go get them while they're in the stores. I got them. Um, it's, it's the collective haul. I went, got a lot of stuff from Forever 21. I actually was going to order some stuff on Forever 21 online. Um, what I did is I went to the store. Everything that I had put in my cart um, online, if, if I could find it in the store, I went ahead and bought it. And then anything else, I went ahead and ordered. And I haven't gotten that in the mail yet. So when that comes, I can show you those things. But that's like literally just like... For items or something um, so I'm just gonna go ahead and get started I feel like it's gonna be it's like there's just a pile here so I'm gonna be leaning down a lot sorry I'm I'll try and organize it a little um, but the first thing I got some of the stuff I've had like for a couple weeks I just haven't worn yet um, one or two things I have um, just because I was waiting to show you but um, I got this jacket this moto jacket from H&M and I am absolutely in love with this jacket. I think it's so pretty. I feel like it's just a nice way to dress up some jeans. It's good for fall. And I like all of like the edgy details. So I feel like this fabric, which I'm not sure if it's like tweed or like that baluche. I don't really know how to say that word. Um, but it's just like it's shiny and black. I feel like it's like a dressy material. But then it's got like with the zippers and making it like moto style just made it very... Um, edgier and I love that and so I saw like an outfit um, a couple of outfit posts with with this jacket and I just not this specific one but you know some celebrity post um, and I just love it so much I was like I'm or love that style so much I just try to find it so I found this H&M and it was only $29.95 so I did I had been looking around so that's one thing I do is like if I find something um that I love or see an outfit like I research at least to see if I can find like a good deal on it and this was the cheapest that I found this jacket um, to have like this quality and I think this jacket's quality is amazing so if you're interested in that it's $30 it, like uh, Elena Del Rey was wearing it in her one of her H&M ads and it's just super cute I love it um the other thing I got from H&M is some boot booties so I definitely have been needing some black booties um the one I have mostly black boots and then the one pair of booties I have I feel like are kind of like those like hiking looking ones like that have laces and stuff I wanted some like more chic looking ones and these are just so so cute um these are $34 and they're there now I like just got this these this weekend and I like that it's like kind of two different uh, materials so it's got the faux leather and then the faux suede in the back and I just really really like them I feel like the heel isn't too cray um got a bit of a platform so I feel like they should be pretty comfortable to walk in and also with the booties I prefer ones that come up my ankle a little bit um, and not just the ones that like dip really low so I liked that so I picked these up because I felt like that's what I was looking for um, so I thought that was great and then uh, the only other things I got from H&M was some jewelry so I have like my lime uh, neon green bag that I have yet to wear and so I got these um, little studs because these are neon I don't know if they're picking up yellow but they're neon and I thought they were just super cute and so I got that and that was $3.95 and then I got these little bracelets um, these little cuff bracelets and that was $7.95 I try to keep everything um if I've worn it like the tags by so I can tell you guys the prices but it's just like silver and gold cute little cuffs um and I just really really like those so I just realized I don't even have any earrings on um that's all the stuff that I got from H&M I didn't get a whole bunch from there but um but since we're on jewelry, I was just wanting to show you guys this piece. So I, if you follow me on Instagram, you saw it. But um, Little Black Bag was doing like a promotion. So they had like where you could get an item for free and just pay the shipping and handling. So I paid. It was like $4.95. And I got this necklace that was like in my selection of things to choose. And I just thought it was pretty cute um, necklace. I mean, I'd prefer it to be a little longer. But, you know, whatever. I mean, for 5 bucks, And I think the quality is pretty good. Um... You know, you never know. This is pretty much my first thing that I got from there, so I might start checking them out. I mean, I really am not into paying, like, 
$50 for like a monthly subscription thing but um, I, I think that the items that they have are nice and so I definitely wanted to try it out at least around Christmas because you could probably use it as some gifts as well and I think that's a good deal. Um, a bulk of the things that I got were from Forever 21 um, on two separate occasions. So the newest stuff that I got, sorry guys, bear with me. Um, well here's some stuff that I got like uh, a couple weeks ago when I went to H&M as well. Um, so there is, I just got this t-shirt, like this love t-shirt, which I thought was pretty cute. Um, just to kind of go under a blazer or, you know, whatever. Pretty much a blazer or like a cardigan or something. So I thought that was cute and that was like ten eighty. Um, and then they had cardigans for like seven dollars like $7.90 so I picked this one up because I feel like I wear a lot of cardigans ex to work um so I was like I can wear this to work for sure for $7.80 that's a great deal it's just a plain black one and then this was like my favorite thing ever because I love like the faux leather details like my favorite thing for fall I swear it is um it's like everything I see I want <laughs> um but it's just a gray t-shirt, and this was like $13.80. Um, I did, I really, really like it. The thing is, I got um, a medium. I would have liked to get a large only because I wanted it to be a little longer, which I don't even know that that would have made it necessarily longer. Sometimes when it's large, it's just like larger out. But I feel like this shirt could stand to be a little longer. Um, but it's fine. I can layer it. Um, I love it. I actually got the last one when I went, and um, I'm very excited about that piece. So, and then I got some, like, just black uh, jeggings or pants or whatever from Forever 21. What are these? They're premium skinny denim, just in black, and they have, like, little zippers on them, which I really didn't get on purpose um, with the zippers, but that was just kind of the first thing I saw, and I needed some new black skinnies. So I got that, um, and... Then I got, just this past weekend, some black leggings um, that are, like, actually thick. So I am just starting to get into wearing leggings. I never really was comfortable wearing them because I feel like my legs are kind of, like, bigger. Um, but I will wear ones that are almost, like, pants. I don't want to get, like, the two for ten. Like, I feel like I just have no business really wearing those. I mean, it's... You really need to be a small leg but hip girl to wear the just like flimsy leggings. Like I wouldn't wear those. I wouldn't even feel comfortable out in public. So I like these. They have like a little bit of detailing on the um, seam or yeah on the inner seam. And they're really heavy. So I, I like that too because obviously it's going to be pretty cold and you don't want to be like freezing in your pants. But there will be no see through showing nothing like that. So and these were like 1780. Um, which, I mean, I guess was okay because I looked around the mall that whole day, um, and the, all this stuff, this, this, the later stuff that I'm showing you is stuff that I got, um, on the Filthy Chic, uh, shopping day, huh? which was so fun. Um, and, um, so this next thing is another pair of denim, so I wanted some just gray jeans, and I liked these little, and these, the jeans both were 1580, so super cheap, right? Um, and I feel like they're, I mean, they have a stretch to them, which I like. This one has something in there. What is that? Um, so, a receipt. Um, interesting. Uh, so I just wanted some gray jeans, so I just picked these up since they were, like, 1580. I'm, like, live, like, literally obsessed with colored jeans right now. I feel like I've bought, in like, a million pairs so far, and, um, I love them all. So... And I'll just keep it going. Um, colored jeans. I got some stuff from Target. So um, I got these jeans from Target. And I wore them to the Filthy Chic event. So that's why they're all like folded and wrinkled or whatever. But they're like I've been looking for this color. I mean I feel like it's looking a little more purpley on screen. But they're definitely like a. It's, the color is called Extra Wine. But I wanted some like Oxblood um, colored je jeans. And so I picked these up and I love them. They're so comfortable and I love the color. I got a lot of compliments. It's just like very fall. Um, I really wanted the the faux leather ones um, in the Oxblood burgundy color from um, H&M, but I couldn't find them. Um, and if I happen to find them, I'll probably still grab them because they're a different material. But I was really hell bent on finding a pair of jeans like this color. The burgundy ones from Forever 21 are more of like a 
more red to me. Um, they're not as red as my red skinnies, but they were more of like a red color. Um, the um, so this next thing is another pair of denim. So I wanted some just gray jeans, and I liked these little, and these, the jeans both were $15.80, so super cheap, right? Um, and I feel like they're, I mean, they have a stretch to them, which I like. This one has something in there. What is that? Um, so, a receipt. Um, interesting uh, so I just wanted some gray jeans so I just picked these up since they were like 1580 I'm like live like literally obsessed with colored jeans right now I feel like I've bought in like a million pairs so far and um, I love them all so and I'll just keep it going um, colored jeans I got some stuff from Target so um, I got these jeans from Target and I wore them to the Filthy Chic event so that's why they're all like folded and wrinkled or whatever but they're like I've been looking for this color I mean I feel like it's looking a little more purpley on screen but they're definitely like a, it's the color is called extra wine but I wanted some like oxblood um, color je jeans and so I picked these up and I love them they're so comfortable and I love the color I got a lot of compliments it's just like very fall um, I really wanted the the faux leather ones um, the, in the oxblood burgundy color from um, H&M but I couldn't find them um, and if I happen to find them I'll probably still grab them because they're a different material but I was really hell-bent on finding a pair of jeans like this color the burgundy ones from forever 21 are more of like a more red to me um, they're not as red as my red skinnies but they were more of like a red color um, and the other thing bag, oh my god I am so obsessed with this so I've been just looking for some more crossbody bags because I have a ton of huge bags and I'm kind of getting burnt out of wearing them and like having such a heavy bag all the time like for shopping and stuff it's nice to have these or if I'm going somewhere so I've been looking for a chain bag because I love um, this detailing on purses crossbody bag and so all the ones I found I thought were really kind of pricey and I was just searching around um, I figured I'd end up getting one for forever 21 for like 25 or almost $30 is which I saw but I was in Target the other day and I came across this bag and um, Target you know how they have like the designer uh, collections and so Karina Zabate I don't know how to, if I'm saying that correctly but she was one of their designers recently and I found this bag for 50% off so it was $20 and like literally the I mean it's seriously got some really great it's a nice quality bag I mean I love the inside is like leopard um, which I thought was really cute and even like down to the pockets still have like the detailing and um, of the same type of detailing I'm not I'm sure this is not real leather, but it definitely feels like it. And I just love, like, animal print and, like, snake skin and, like, all those type of detailing. So I love, love, love this bag. Favorite. Uh, they also had in a bright blue color. Um, and I, I got the last black one. They had a couple of blue ones. So you should just definitely check your target purse section and see if you're interested in looking for this. Because for 20 bucks, I mean, awesome. It was, like, a $40 bag. Um, so the last thing I got from Target was this shirt here um and it has like like a little faux suede detailing and it's like long in the back and short in the front the high low hemline and i just thought this would be like a nice little comfy shirt to wear so um i have got that um the last few things i got were from marshall's and Ross so I actually don't spend too much time shopping in Marshalls or Ross because I just get irritated looking through stuff but when you go and you find stuff it's like why don't I come here more often so at Ross I really was just looking for like a denim shirt because my sister had one or a chambray um and she said she found it there and I ended up coming out they, the one I found had like a broken button they didn't have any more so I ended up coming out with just some basic like little tops that I thought would be comfy and this one is so soft and comfy it's just like navy blue and black stripe I just thought it'd be pretty comfortable it's pretty long nice with jeans you know just some something to wear like when I'm chilling going to my mom's or like to the, to the mall or something and then I got this cute little leopard sweatshirt and I wore it the other day like on Saturday because it was just like running our Sunday because we were just running some quick errands and I wore it off the shoulder I just thought it was really cute little sweatshirt um, it's like a burnout look and these were both like six bucks so that's awesome oh I just realized I didn't tell you the price on the jeans um 
the oxblood jeans the, from from Target were twenty two dollars, and that shirt from Target was sixteen ninety nine. Super good deal. I don't know necessarily if I'm gonna keep this top. I still have the tags on and everything, and I like it, but um, I'm just gonna have to see how it looks with like when I try to put it on with the outfit the other day. I, I took it off. But oh, it has like this little black zipper on it. I guess I should. Okay, rewind all over the place. Um. Anyways, um, and then the last couple things I got in, um, were from Marshalls, and these are some of, like, my favorite finds. So I got this dress. <gasps> Ugh, I am obsessed with it. So it's, like, this camel dress. It's, like, every single trend thrown into one dress. It's camel dress, love. Faux leather detailing on the sides, love. And then the pleated skirt, which is, like, huge right now, love. Perfect for fall. I feel like I could throw a blazer on this, some booties. Oh, I'm so excited. I think this will be like a perfect like date night outfit or something. So, and it's, this was $16.99. They had it in navy with the black leather detailing, which was also pretty cute, but I just really wanted this color. Um, I feel like it looks very equestrian, which I'm kind of like into that look a little bit. Um, very, very cute. Uh, then I got this blouse. So, you know, I like love blouses. Um, and my sister actually convinced me to get it because she's like, the green is so pretty on you. And I think actually one of my YouTube girlies has this um, blouse, if I'm not mistaken. Lucky. Um, so, comment below, Lucky, if you're watching. If you do, I feel like you wore this to one of our events. Um, so, I got this green one. I just like the little black contrast to it. I mean, the detailing is pretty cute. Um, and this is $14.99. So, they had a lot of blouses for, like, $14.99. I feel like the cheapest blouses I usually see are at Forever 21, and they are at, like, $19 to $24. So, go check out your local TJ Maxx, Ross, Target. I'm uh, not Target. Marshalls. They have all that. And then, finally, I got my denim, chambray, whatever you want to call it. Um, sure. This is really what I went for, and I came out with all that other stuff. Um, and I like it because I do like how it's like the fadeaways are. It's like a little rustic, and um, these just look so cute with all the colored jeans. I've seen so many people styling with these, and I love it. So I felt like I had to have that. Like it's definitely closet staple. So what do we take home from this? Is faux leather detailing and a denim chambray shirt. That's all you need, and some colored skinnies. There's fall. <laughs> There's fall clothing in a package. Oh, and blouses and blouses. So, um, that is finally everything. Um, if you have any other questions or comments, whatever, just leave them in the comment section below, and I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.